Hi, Stephanie here from Simply On Demand. And um, let me show you how you can resize. This is a YouTube thumbnail, a YouTube thumbnail for an Instagram post or a Twitter um, post or you name it, you can resize it. If you have Canva Pro, you can simply click on resize and decide what you want to resize it to. Let's make it a story. And then you can copy and resize and it will open up a new design for you. So, but we're not going to do that. We're going on the assumption that you do not have a Canva Pro account. So what we'll do is just make sure that none of the uh, elements are locked. So when we lock something in place, like I've just done with that, when we select everything, that which is locked, you can see the blue outline over there, does not get selected. So make sure that none of your elements, um, your brand elements, your everything is locked. Everything should be unlocked. So the first thing you do is either Command A or Control A on your keyboard to select everything. If you don't want to do that and you want to use your mouse, simply click off the design and drag it across the design to select everything. And now Control C or Command C, go to your home page and let's create a design, a Facebook post that we can do like that. These are Facebook post size. Now we did not use the resize function. So now what we're going to do is simply paste it onto that blank canvas. Now you can see it simply is still in a YouTube thumbnail size. And now you can go and do what you need to do. And we don't want to select that. Let's just lock that in place so we don't select it. And now you can go and do everything that you need to and simply resize it. So instead of having to subscribe to Canva Pro right off the bat, simply take it, select everything, create a new design, which is then opened. Let's just move that one over there. Um, and then paste it. And if we want to create a story, we'll simply use exactly what we've copied previously. Click on the canvas and paste it in there. As you can see, once again, we're going to have to do a little bit of resizing ourselves. Let's lock that in place. Take that and put that over there and we'll do that bit over there just ever so slightly and this is really very very easy a very easy way of resizing that what you have just done previously so you do not need to have canva pro in order to resize a design you can simply select it all. Remember to unlock your, your elements. Select it all. Go to your home page. Click on new, create new design. And just do a little bit of manipulation in order to get your, to get your um, design looking the way you want it to. And that's how easy it is to resize without having Canva Pro as such. If you have any questions, please do get in touch. I'm happy to always talk with you. All the very best and take care.